August 14th, hey, huh? In the pre-dawn hours of August 14th, 128 adventurers gathered on the prairie near Bear Butte to begin a journey. A journey that will take them through the Black Hills and Badlands of South Dakota. All have a goal for their journey. For some elite athletes, it is winning. For the majority, it is a journey that they can only hope to complete. For the next 10 days and nights, four people must work, think, eat, and sleep as one. They will travel 600 miles by foot, by bike, kayak, ropes, and swimming. The real journey will be within them. Can they find the mental toughness to overcome the physical challenges that will come day after day and night after night? They are quiet and wondering what will get to them. Will it be the lack of sleep, weather, injuries, getting lost, broken equipment, or will they just run out of time? Will they be able to go inside themselves and find that something that they didn't know they had? Can they find the mental and physical strength, the desire, the love, and the spirit to overcome? Can they complete their primal quest? Yeah. This is the first one? But you don't get to do the ropes course. We made it. We made it by 6.30. You have to be on the ropes by 7. Hey, I, I understand that uh, we're, we're, we're getting shut down for going on the ropes, but um, understand that the whole, the whole last day and a half, they've been saying we had to be at checkpoint 20 by 7 o'clock. Yeah, I didn't know that. Well, yeah. let's, uh, let's, plan, let's plan like we're going to go. Got over the cutoffs by two minutes, but they allowed us to go with a bottle of scotch as a repayment. So that was in dusk, and we've just done a repel, and then we did a huge jimmer, zip, zip line, and now we're about to do a free climb. And it's taxing. <laughs> Are you okay up there? Yeah, a little spent on the high line there.
Yeah. A feeling that you get. It was pretty, it was really, it was pretty cool. It would have been nice in the day too.